What's up, everybody? Uh, Prince of Persia, normal difficulty. Uh, Umbrizo, that's Mr. Frags, correct? And that's an achievement. Yeah. By the way, you are under arrest. That's why we're in the prison. You know, I gotta say, we are the only people who are kind of unique like that, as in making these little puns before all of our videos, most of them. Well, it, you know, it is a part of the job, so let's just do it. Yeah. Um, Mate. That achievement, by the way, was for wall running a uh, certain distance, which accumulates over time, and you pretty much can't miss it. Whoa, you just stabbed that dude. What? Like when that finishing movie did where you just stabbed that dude? That is the most violent thing I've seen out of this whole game. I gotta say. Yeah, th some of the finishing moves are actually really cool, but... There's no blood or anything, so... No, but even so... It like, doesn't matter. They could do whatever they want. Some of the other finishing moves I've seen, they, he just, like, hits them with the butt end of his sword. <laughs> yeah, or, like, punch them in the nuts or something. And, yeah. And now he's just stabbing um, him through the chest. Like, it's his job. Yeah, that achievement that just popped up before, that was for killing a certain amount of enemies with the finishing move, which you do when they're knocked down. It's really, really easy stuff. So what's the hardest achievement to get in this game? Hmm. Um, there's a couple of them where you have to defeat the boss without getting hit. That's that's pretty difficult. That just sounds uh, that can, bull crap. Uh, it pretty much is. Um, it's really easy to do if you have certain upgrades. Look at this. But if you don't have them, you're gonna have to be get really lucky and be really good. Are you are you either of the two? I am both at all times. There you go. So I think I explained it in the Gates video that uh, you really need to get used to platforming on water because this game, oh, sorry, not this game, this palace that you're in has holes like nobody's business and there's water just pouring out of every single one of them. The palace couldn't hold its fluids. Yeah, this... This, um, not only does this palace get drunk off two beers, but it's pissing like every two minutes. Pissing like a racehorse. Yeah. Like a line of. Like a Persian racehorse. Yeah. Like, you know that horse Ezio rides into town all the time? Like yeah. That horse. Listen, I don't know if my jokes are that bad. It's not that they're bad, it's I'm sitting here trying to think of stuff to talk about other than alright, wall run. Go some more wall run. Oh check it out, I had I messed up so I had to like reverse time. You can do that in this game. Sounds like cheating. Um I I wish there was a difficulty that uh took that ability away from you. Dude, if I ever went to prison, I would request that my prison cell be hung in the air. <laughs> For real. Because that is honestly the coolest thing that would ever happen to me. I would just piss the guards off and swing my cell back and forth. You think they'd appreciate that? I don't Well, they couldn't come up there and beat you, but then again, how would they feed you? Um, uh, Slingshots? Like an ugly child? Mm -hmm. Just slingshot your food to, to it? They'd have to be a damn good shot. <laughs> so I don't remember if... I, I don't think I spoke about it here, but... Um, I did tell you that I wasn't sure when I started playing this game if there was like a hard difficulty or not, because uh, the only options they give you right off the bat are uh, easy and normal. Yep. Uh, playing through it now for the third time, which... This is a second time playthrough recording. I'm playing it through a third time, trying to get all the uh, achievements out of it. But I wish they would have added in like a hard difficulty that took away certain things. Like you can't reverse time. Um, uh, let's see. They took away some of the abilities, except for like maybe the stone armor, because there's these uh, magic powers you can use, and most of them are pretty much the same. You know. You haven't played the 2008 Prince of Persia, but no, not there's yet. literally no penalty for like falling off a cliff in that game. Like, 
When you uh, the only penalty is it disqualifies you from gamer score. Yeah. But like. But that that is a penalty greater than death itself, you know. I I know, but like, for those non-believers in the gamer score or religion. <laughs> yeah. There's death to them, by the way. Yeah, we're coming. We're gonna hang you from a tree. That was almost too far, wasn't it? Nah, not far enough. <laughs> I agree. So, one of the problems I have with this game is, it looks... I think we already spoke about this, but not enough. Like, how boring is this to watch? Yeah, we spoke about this. I think we speak about this every guide we do. Yeah, because, I mean, I'm watching it now, for, and it's like 90 degrees where I'm sitting right now. It's it's horribly uncomfortable. I'm like, damn. First, I'm really good at this game. Like, check me out. But second, this game is boring to talk about. A lot of games are. You know what games are? Oh, that's the last time. That's the last time. You know what game's fun to talk about? Lost Planet. Oh, you got me there. Uh, I was going to say Killzone 2, but you won up me on that one. <laughs> Could Lost Planet become the new kill zone too? Oh, I don't even know. Like I think Lost Planet should be its own thing. What is it like its own category? Yeah. Like you know how Kill Zone 2 made its own category? Yeah. Lost Planet did the same. But now I'm curious, you know. What as to how bad Lost Planet is? Yeah, like how bad could it possibly be? You're not gonna think at first you're gonna think it's boring. And then maybe once about the third chapter comes, you're gonna get horribly, hardly pissed off. But I, I don't get pissed off. I've seen you get pissed off a few times. Mm, I don't think so. Not pissed off to the point of like breaking controllers, but pissed off to the point where you weren't enjoying the game itself. You know, if they wrote a biography about you, it would be called lies and the people who tell them <laughs> if they wrote a book about you it would be called people who get pissed off you know how I know you're lying how? your mouth is moving oh snap oh by the way I totally just screwed up that jump I don't know how that happened it's pretty embarrassing watching it now yo nothing is better than that little blooper you gave me yeah but you know I'm cutting up the rest of the video, the rest of the walkthrough, and there really weren't any, any just quite as bad as me just kind of jumping off the cliff and coming up short five feet from a jump. Just put it on your channel then. Well, I was going to, but that was the plan, but still, I mean, there's really nothing even comparable to that. It's hilarious, I'll tell you that much. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh! oh, oh. oh. Yeah, I made it. Not only did I make it, but there's a sarcophagus up here. You not only did you make it, but you made it with style. I do everything with style. Look at you. you oh, Except for that. Yeah, that wasn't too much style. <laughs> I don't know. I gotta admit, you broke that vase with style. Nobody breaks the vases like I do. Or vases. Which one? Sarcophagi. Sarcophagus. I have to find a new way to call them, a new thing to say about them. I'm not gonna stress my brain too much about it. After this guide, I'm probably never gonna say sarcophagus again in my life. Eh, probably. Hey, remember that time when I said I wasn't gonna show what I upgraded anymore? Yeah. yeah oops. <laughs> hey, guess who forgot to edit out what they were upgrading? Dude, you couldn't get that lucky again if you tried. What do you mean? The way you just ran through those arrows without stopping. For all, <laughs> for all I, I don't give a shit about any arrows. For all I know, when you were recording, you pretty much just closed your eyes, like put your hand in front of your eyes and held the stick forward and said, okay. It was kind of something like that. Well, I had just upgraded my health. Look how, look how long my health is. I'll take, I don't care about any arrows. Listen. Or any saws that are somehow coming out of the walls. Your your health bar is longer than my Wiimote. Oh fuck!